I shared this card on my blog recently and it uses a technique that is called thumping to get the uh, multicolored stamped image. And I just want to show you real quick how to do that technique today. So these are the things that you need for the thumping technique. You need a stamp with a lot of solid um, image to it. You can see that there's, there's a lot of solid area here on the snowflakes. A light colored ink to be your base color. And then one or more of the Stampin' Up! markers. Um, these are just the Stampin' Write markers. This technique will not work with the new blend abilities. Um, one or more markers that are a darker color than your base ink. So the first thing you're going to do is use your light colored ink to ink up your stamp. <clears throat> and then you're going to take the brush tip, the larger tip of your marker, and you're just going to hold this in your fingers and kind of bounce it up and down, like if you're bored at work and you're tapping your pencil on your desk, just kind of bounce it in your fingers and you're going to do that all over the stamped image. And I'm doing this randomly, I'm really not thinking too much about it. If you want to kind of slow down and make sure, you know, that you've got the ink where you exactly where you want it, you can be a little bit more intentional, but I like the random look. And then I like to turn it different directions too to get the um, Um, the direction of the you know little spots of red to look a little bit different and now because you've been working on this for a little while um, and your ink has had a chance to start drying what you want to do is huff on your stamp which is you breathe warm moist air over the surface of the stamp to reactivate the ink <sighs> And then you can go ahead and stamp. Because this is a large solid stamp, you want to give it some good pressure and uh, walk your fingers around the stamp to make sure you're covering all the different pieces. And there you have your fun multicolored stamped image.